Hey you guys, it is 8.55 p.m. on Friday, December 6, 2019. Um, I don't think my previous video for this uploaded, but I wanted to show you what I got from BoxyCharm. And I'm sorry I don't have the tripod facing me right now. I need to get another new selfie stick. It tipped over and it broke it again. I thought I had one laying here somewhere. I'll look for it again. But I'm pretty sure I don't, but I'll find it later anyways. Um, I'm going to show you what I got. My mom and sister are going to trade... My sister's going to trade me um, an eyeshadow palette for this because I'm not really a big fan of dry shampoos. So I'm just going to, like, put that aside. Um, my mom gave me her uh, hair wrap towel. And I've actually been wanting one of these for a while now because um, I actually use a regular towel for my hair and it's a joke. And I got one myself. But having two of them is just nicer so that I can actually uh, wash one when I'm not using the other. So here's the packaging for that. Sorry. I don't know why there's a plastic bag in here. Oh, I brought that up here for something else. Um, I got this M Greengrass Beach Air. I know I can't get it to focus. Sorry, my hand. Sorry, my single hand work is not great here. Okay, M Green Grass Dry Oil Spray Fragrance Number Two, inspired by Greece. Beach Air. And it just says the fragrance notes down there. I'm not really interested in that. Um, I got this book eyeshadow palette here. This is uh, hold on. Let me turn it around here. My sister's gonna give me another one like this. She don't like the colors that are in there. Sorry about the mess, by the way. It is the Storybook Cosmetics Fairy Tales Eyeshadow Palette. I actually thought this was like some kind of Bible when I opened this, believe it or not. Like I thought, oh, there's any Bibles out now. But no, I got a big surprise. And I, I've actually seen these before in the store. So I really do like this. And I'm gonna try it tomorrow. I'm sorry my box here isn't letting it focus very well. But, however, I did get the, uh, Kayati or Siati or Chati. I don't know how you pronounce I don't know how you pronounce it. Confetti Highlighter. It's, a uh, Kayati London. Kayati London. Whatever it is. Confetti Highlighter. Uh, it's very pretty, actually. I do like it. I've had a few things from this brand before from, uh, Ipsy. Let me try and open it here. I'm gonna have to set the camera down for that. My mom and sister also got it, and I don't know if I'll be getting my sister's because she's not really a big fan of highlighters. But look at how pretty that is. I mean, I swatched it on my hand earlier, but I'm going to swatch it again now that I've got a clean finger. Okay, so clean finger. Look down here. One swat. And look how much came on. So that just tells me me and that highlighter are going to be best friends. Some of this stuff my mom and I traded because she's not really much into wearing a whole lot of stuff on her body, on her face. Um, I got this Power Up Dual Face Setting Mist. And uh, she traded me this for something else. It was for the face wash that I got. And uh, I got one of these. Vib not vibrators, duh. I thought it was like one of those uh, vibrating neck things. Um... It's Cosmetics Clean Clinical Luxurious. I thought this was like a bracelet or something. Oh, it doesn't say anything on the back, but that's what it looks like on that little pamphlet. And my mom gave me uh, her eye her eyeshadow, but her lip gloss by uh, Tarte. Or sorry, Too Faced. Duh. This is the shade she got, and this is the shade I got. Um. Crazy Rich and Two Night Stand. I uh, can't wait to try this. Or Second Night Stand, however you pronounce it. I don't know. But yeah, this is um, what I got from BoxyCharm this month. And I don't know if we're going to be able to renew our subscription next next year, I should say. Because this is the final month of the year. Because of uh, financial issues. But um, if so, I hope that I will be able to get it at least. Uh even if I have to get a little job and start paying for it myself, I'm not losing my boxy charm one way or another. I'm keeping it. But 
Um, that's it uh, until my Ipsy bag arrives, whichever, whenever that will arrive. I actually should look in the app. If you don't have the Ipsy app you and you have Ipsy, you definitely need to download it because it will tell you when your Ipsy bag will be there as well. I love Ipsy and I love BoxyCharm, so I've decided that I'm going to keep both for as long as I can, but if I have to get rid of one or the other, I'm definitely getting rid of Ipsy. And I'm not bashing it, it's just financial issues right now. But for now, not like right right now, but maybe say a couple months from now if I have to get rid of it, I will. I don't know why I'm explaining myself, but um, also that's the same reason I can't use my tripod. Let me show you my tripod here. Mine, uh, mine the mess. That's the tripod I used to film, and uh, obviously you see a little screw thing on top of it for the phone, and it just won't work, so. Yeah. I don't have one of those phone things anymore that actually go, you know, like on top. I think I do somewhere once again, I'll look again, because I'm pretty sure I bought one a couple months ago in case that happened again, and I was right to do that. Um, but if not, I can just get one for $2, and $2 at Walmart. I mean, that's how I film. But, uh, I'm gonna let you guys go now. Um, thank you for watching. In case I don't post any more videos before Christmas, I hope you have a wonderful Christmas, and Merry Christmas, and a Merry Christmas Eve, or whatever. Thank you for watching. Bye. Also, the time is now... I don't have my iPad handy right at the moment. Let me look. Time is now 9.02 p.m. Bye.